Oprah Winfrey's newest feel-good show is premiering on Sunday night. It's called Oprah's Big Give. It has contestants competing to win money, but then to give that money to charity. So why is my next guest saying it's all about Oprah raking in some more cash for herself? Well, he's internet evangelist Bill Keller. Bill, you know, I enjoy Oprah. I'm an Oprah fan. What do you have against her? Well, I got to tell you, Terry, first of all, it's good to be with you. I've been telling people for years that Oprah is probably the most dangerous woman on the world. And, and let me tell you why I say that. I understand that she makes people feel good and her program does a lot of nice things. But her program has evolved over the years to the point now where she is really the queen of the new age gurus. She has started on her XM satellite station January 1st teaching a course in miracles that is nothing but regurgitated new age teachings from centuries old. Monday night she starts a 10-week course on a new earth which is off of a book written by Eckhart Tolle, a great new age uh, uh, pursuant. And the fact is Oprah is making a fortune pushing new age philosophies oh. down people's throat. Well she's doing now, it he, I guess because it sells or because people sure. like to watch her. Well, well he, he, here's the problem. She claims to be a Christian, and the problem is a Christian believes that this book is the only truth there is, and Jesus Christ is the only way to be saved. The problem is these New Age teachings are, are, are really sucking in millions of people into these false philosophies, these false theologies, and they're literally leading people to hell. Oprah, whether she knows it or not, is really being a conduit to lead people to hell but, if you believe the Bible to be true. But that's not most of her program. I mean, it, a lot of it's, you know, weight loss, makeovers, things of, things of that sort. Um, you, you, to, and I mean, you're right, you, you're right, Terry, but lately she has become, like I said, the queen of the New Age gurus, as last year she was a big proponent of The Secret, another New Age philosophy. Like I said, on her XM satellite station, starting January 1st, she's been pushing this course on miracles, a year-long New Age course that basically says there is no sin. If there's no sin, that means you don't need a Savior. And again, Monday night, she starts her latest venture, which, you know, the fact is there's a million people plus that are going to be plugged into this 10-week course. That means a million people plus have bought the book. There's a, a accompanying paraphernalia that goes with it, and she's going to rake yeah. in millions of dollars. But the problem is she's leading people down a road of destruction if, again, you believe the Bible to be true okay. and Christ to be the only way to be saved. All right. Well, she's, she's also she's trying to sell woman. us our next president, for who she hopes is our next president. She's, uh, she's doing that well as well. Thanks, Bill, and for your insights. You, okay. Always provocative.